second ago, guys, something must have scared them off. Oh my gosh, it was probably that 33 foot python. You know, pythons are usually pretty friendly, but they will develop a crush on you. So be careful. Do you mind if we stop at my camp real fast and pick up some snakes right there? Oh man. I hired these gorillas to break camp for me. It looks like they broke everything. Hey, look at the gorillas. The good news is I couldn't get that jeep to start this morning, and it looks like they finally got it to turn over. They must have used a monkey wrench. Oh, or oh, 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 oh. Let's do it. No, that's okay. Well, guys, we're now on the Nile River. The Nile's the longest river. Oh, it's an elephant. There's an elephant coming. There's more Niles and Niles. And if you don't believe me, you're in denial. Oh, that's right. Here on the left is an African elephant. Can anybody tell me how we can tell he's an African elephant? Because he's in Africa. Geography. Speak! What are you feeling? Practice. Well, this right here on the right is our sandstone rock formation. Now, I do like to point it out because most of my guests take it for granted. I think it's one of our bolder attractions, though. It rocks. Yeah, my jokes aren't going to get better from here, guys. But we're now on the African Dog, where this pride of lions is demonstrating the number one rule of the jungle. Don't be a zebra. Don't worry, though. He's just sleeping. He must be dead. Tired. Dead tired. This right up here is my last crew. I dropped oh, them off at this point because nobody would laugh at any of my jokes. It's very bizarre. You know, I told them that they weren't going to be able to outrun a rhino and they didn't believe me. But it looks like they'll get the point. In the end, I would hate to be the low man on that totem pole. And that's actually a hauntus there on the bottom. That right that's pretty funny, huh? Yeah. Uh oh, guys. Uh, we're now a true man. Now the big crocodile on the left is old Smiley. You don't really have to worry much about him, but on the right is his friend Ginger. Be careful. Ginger snaps. Yeah, she's one tough cookie. I know my jokes are crummy, but I like to melt them for all their worth, so bear with me. And if you don't like them, that's the way the cookie crumbles. That feels good. You know, most of my guests ask me how I landed my job at the Jungle Cruise while I was playing to see. I took the crash course, and I'm pretty much still winging it. But you know, when you've been in the jungle as long as I have, you really begin to smell. Danger. That was an awkward place for a pause, but, uh, oh, guys, I'm not hungry, I'm hungry, I'm hungry, I'm calm, but they have been known to capsize the boat or two, so if you're wearing a white shirt, please don't make any noises like a marble. These are hungry, hungry hippos. Hey, I'm covering the camera. Yeah, looks like we're huh? safe, guys, but we're not out of the woods yet. Which probably explains the yeah, trees. The hippo usually sprays the boat, so I was saying tree, cover the camera. Which is not a very good place to be headed. Oh no. When the native stands like this, it only means one thing. It means they're about to attack. Now the only thing I know about natives is that they only attack on the right hand side of the boat. So keep your eyes peeled out here on the right hand side. They've got to be out there somewhere. Does anybody see them? What? Oh my gosh, guys, don't move a muscle. They might not attack. Don't move. Don't move! Now we made it. Alrighty. Looks like they're a little slow today. That's alright. Waterfall! Waterfall!